As my attacker attacks with his right hand, I deflect his punch with my left hand, grabbing hold of his left shoulder and his belt at the same time. Turning him around and uh, dropping his back on my knee, delivering three strikes to his hyperextended abdominals, grabbing his leg, holding him over, and putting him into a submission hole. That's when my opponent comes to attack me with the right hand again. I collect his energy, pulling him off balance, striking him with a back fist to distract him from the wrist lock I'm going to use to take him to the ground. This position, I dangle his body weight off his wrist to sprain his wrist, I rotate him around to control him, and deliver a finishing strike to the base of his skull. Attack, my attacker attacks me with a left hand punch. I move to the outside of the number three direction movement line, kicking him with a roundhouse kick to the face, and landing my kick with the right hand to the chin. I take advantage of the fact that his elbow is in front of my chest, and I pop his elbow, bring him to the ground, keeping his arm fully extended. This position, I deliver another palm straight to his elbow, and a finishing blow to the side of the head. My attacker attacks him with his right hand, steps to the outside, giving a hook kick to the base of the skull, palm strike to the chin, collecting his energy, putting him around my knee, giving him some palm strikes to the back of the head, collecting his arm on the way down. I, I break his elbow and deliver a finishing strike to his ribs. with an elbow to the side of the head. I move in a number five directional movement line, redirecting it away from my head. I overextend his energy, bringing him to the ground. In this position, I rotate his wrist around and put him on his belly and smash his elbow into the ground while simultaneously spraining his wrist. From here, I step around him. I step around him, dislocating his shoulder off my leg and delivering a final blow to the space of the skull. Right. This time my attacker attacks me with his left rear leg. The front kick. I step out of the way on number six directional movement line. Deliver a chop to his knee and rotate his leg over. From here, I take him off balance by extending him out. I wrap my leg around his, putting him into a leg lock, deliver a strike to his kidney, pulling his head back, and finishing him off to the top of the neck. This attack, my opponent attacks him with the left jab. I move forward on the number seven directional movement line, delivering a knee to his stomach. I land with a large chop to his elbow. I cross him straight down with all my body weight, rolling him over to a position where I can kneel on his head and deliver, deliver a finishing strike to his temple. In this attack, my opponent attacks with a large right hand strike. I step back, delivering a side kick to his ribs and a punch to the back of his skull. From here, I collect the energy of his head snapping back. Redirect it down and around to a controlling technique where I palm strike him in the head, then down my front, and give him a kick in the head on the way down. Oh. <laughs> Attacker comes at me with a straight right hand. I move in on number one directional movement line, strike him to his ribs. I then continue his energy coming forward by collecting the back of his head while simultaneously checking his elbow, stepping backwards, moving him to the ground while still controlling his arm, move him into a bent arm lock, striking to the base of the skull.
tackler comes at me, the left hand, I step back on number two directional movement line, kicking him into the ribs. As my energy comes forward, I strike my attacker in the head. I now have his arm collected across my body. I bring him into what attempts to be an armbar. As my attacker spins underneath me, I bring his arm back around, striking him to the base of the skull. As my attacker comes at me with the left hand, I step out at number three direction of movement line, checking his strike while simultaneously palm striking him to the side of the head. Come in, collecting his knee, chopping and hyperextending his elbow. From there, I elbow to the spine, hammer fist in the skull. As I move backwards, I take him to the ground while still controlling his arm, finishing my attacker with a strike to the skull. My attacker comes at me with a right leg and rear thrust kick. I collect it with my right arm. We'll bring my left across his shoulders. As I circle around, I bring it to the ground. While still controlling his leg, I put my knee into his hamstring, turning him over. I then grab his head, delivering a finishing chop to the neck. My attacker grabs me on my right shoulder. I collect his arm with my left hand. While moving on a number five directional movement line, I put him into a straight arm lock, knee him to his exposed ribs. Using my body weight, I drive my elbow into the same spot I need. As he tries to roll over, I keep his arm up, delivering two knees to his back. As my opponent comes on me with the left hand, I move out on the number six directional movement line. Using a water technique, come back in, straight to his ribs. I take his extended arm, popping it on my shoulder, circling around him into a key lock, bringing my opponent to the ground, using a controlling technique to put him on his stomach, finishing off my attacker with a strike to the base of the skull. As my opponent comes out with the left hand straight, I counter cross, moving on a number seven directional movement line, striking him to the neck with an outside pseudo chop. My left hand comes forward. I get strike him to the neck with a rich hand, which feeds into my scissor choke as I bring him backwards, taking the center of gravity and choking my opponent out. As my attack comes on me with a large right hand, I move out number eight direction of movement line. As he comes around, I'm striking to his stomach with a side kick, bending him over, Kneeing him to the head, also bringing down a strike to the base of his skull, finishing my attacker. Attacker comes with a straight right. Move in on number one, striking to the head. Take, follow up with the left, taking the arm into an arm bar. You resist. Take him back into a key lock, drop him to the ground, controlling the arm, finish his right to the base of the skull. Okay, Tackard comes with a forward right. Move back on number two, extending his energy out as he goes off top. So go right in, rich hand to the clavicle, palm strike, and just falls back into a sleeper, choking him up, walking him to the ground. Captain comes with the straight left, move off on a number three, straight to the chin, block the arm with my right elbow, then extending his energy down, straight to the ground, pulling him to an arm bar. As he drops, I hyperextend his arm across my knee with my elbow, then finishing strikes to the third vertebrae of the neck. Two. And it's done. Attacker comes with a straight right. Move off to number four, straight to the 
the side of the head. Come up with a round pulse and simultaneously come with a bridge hand to the clavicle as my leg goes around, bending them over. As you start to drop, come with a palm strike to the back of the head, follow another palm strike underneath the chin, slam the steps into the ground, finishing the attack. Tackle comes to the right, moving on number five, striking to the head, follow up with the left to the head, collecting the arm, controlling it as you try to go under, extend the energy out, lifting the arm up, controlling it, finishing the right to the neck. Tackle comes with a push on the left, move back on number six. Striking to the side of the head, pulling his arm into arm bar, coming with an elbow to the side of the head, lifting him back, my elbow to his clavicle, and then down, still controlling the arm, hyperextending it, and then finishing blow to the head. Tackle comes with the left. Tackle leading on number seven, striking to the head. I come in, bending him down, the knee to the back, elbow to the side of the head. I reach around, put a reverse guillotine, hyperextend the elbow at the same time, follow up with the knee to the small of the back, and elbow to the sternum, finishing the attack. comes with a straight right. Move up on a number eight, strike to the back of the knee, turning him around. I block with my left forearm into a palm strike to the side of the head, another palm strike, selecting his arm, taking him up into an armor again, popping it across my body with a finishing strike to his third vertebrae. My opponent comes in 
with a straight crunch. I step back on a number six while saw, slide striking him in the head. He then comes for a round. I duck under while punching him in the stomach. Since he's bent over, I elbow him in the back of the head. My opponent grabs both of my collars, pulls me towards him. I go on a number seven while grabbing his opposite elbow, redirecting his energy up, keeping his arm, bringing him down, turning him over, and controlling him here, and adding a little pain by pulling. My opponent comes striking right through me. I come over top of his arm, getting a hold of his wrist. I overextend him, but when he's off balance, I change the direction and wrist throw him. I then reverse the energy back, arm bar him, and finish him, strike to the kidney. comes in, grabs my right left, left collar and pulls, grab the hand, at the same time shooting forward on number one, sneaking my arm around in front of her face, stepping behind her legs, dropping right in front of me, twisting the arm, bending the wrist back, finishing with a straight to the ribs. Each time it comes to put on my left collar, I turn to do the one staying on me, but she's smart and checks my left hip so I can't complete the throw. I turn up to the outside, and sitting very tall, twisting her arm, rolling it down, left leg around her neck, twisting the arm, first submission here. Here comes and bear hugs me from behind. I drop down to the right and splitting my arms apart with snaps to break her grip. Grab the foot below me, use my hips as a fulcrum. Turn her over, sitting down with her leg locked in between mine, grabbing the hair, punching the back of the head. Tiger comes in with the jab, correct. I move to the side to avoid the strike. I hook punch, I duck under, jab comes again, I redirect it over to the side, come over with my right arm. Into a choke and drop it. Tiger comes in with a spinning side kick. I step forward on number five in front of the foot. At that point, I push it down, offer center of balance, then lean really forward, finishing with strikes to the side of the head. Comes in with a knife stab to my chest. I shoot back into the side, checking the knife hand, twisting the wrist. At this point, she merely grip the knife. If not, I stab in the ribs, turn it against my chest, and finish with a strike to the ribs. Jack comes in to pull on my left right collar, check the hand, hold stepping forward, strike into the head. From there, stepping to the outside and rotating her arm around and her head at the same time. Finger down, dropping down on the strike to the base of that side of the okay. okay, Doctor comes first with a diagonal swing, I dodge her the way up, has back across, elbow in the face as I come in from that, bringing the arm around. Around the head, facing with a choke with the handle. Dropping when she's up. Hey! Hey! Two opponents come up from either side of me, grabbing me by the wrist. I step forward on the number one, crossing my hands, grabbing onto each one of theirs. Turning around, stepping again on number one, rolling forward, 
throwing them, stomp to the head. My opponent shoots in, trying to take my legs out. I shoot back on a number two, wrapping my arms around his throat, dropping to the ground. My opponent tries to roll up over on his back. I follow the motion, come up on top, elbow to the head, grabbing his arm, rolling back, and putting him in a straight arm bar. My opponent comes in with a straight strike. I move out on a number three. Snapping the arm, coming in, striking to the side of the head, striking to the throat. My opponent comes in trying to throw me with Tomonagi. I step out on number four, letting his energy go across, chopping to the side of his throat, dropping him down, keeping the arm, stepping over, putting him in a straight arm bar. My opponent comes in with a hook punch. I step forward on a number of five, wrapping my arm around the back of his head, spinning his energy down, coming up. So I come into a choke. My opponent comes in with an over half strike to the staff. I step back on a number six. I step forward, continuing the motion, bringing the staff down, hooking his leg, throwing him to the ground, and striking him to the head. My opponent comes up from behind and grabs me. I step forward on number seven, pulling him forward with me, hitting him into the back of the head, redirecting his energy down, throwing him to the ground, striking to the head. Hey! My opponent comes in, tries to grab me and throw me with him on Zionagi. I check him so that he can't continue the throw. He loops out of it, putting me in. Chicken wing this time. I come around, scooping his arm this way, stepping behind, throwing him to the ground, straight into the head. As I come to front thrust my opponent, he intercepts my leg, coming in to take my leg down. Step in. As he goes to push me down, I go down, my leg behind him, doing a leg take down, taking his other leg, I bring extending his knee. As I go to strike my opponent, he comes off with a side kick, following through with a punch. I redirect his punch, intersecting him by the face. Taking him back down, around into a circle, picking him up on his neck, popping his arm, and choking him. I come to explode through with a front thrust kick. My opponent intercepts my leg, coming to take me down. As he comes to take me down, I come around, pop his arm with my chest, roll over. Put him into an armbar, elbowing him to the face. Ah! I come to strike my opponent. He steps back with a reverse punch, intercepting my arm coming to take me into an armbar. I take his arm, come down for a reversal, stepping back in position here, having his elbow locked up against my chest, torquing out his arm. come to strike my opponent, he comes in, just intercepting into a scissor choke. I redirect his scissor choke around, taking him down, popping his arm, and doing a finishing strike to the base of the skull. As my attacker comes and puts a rope around my neck, I grab onto the rope as he pulls me back. I step back with it, elbowing him to his center stepping behind his leg, 
As I step up behind him, I pick up on his chin, grab onto the rope, pull him down, and choke him. As I come to strike my opponent, he takes my arm to go into an arm lock. I intercept him, elbowing him into his stomach, kneeing him into a chest, kicking out his knee, stepping around, popping his arm, and doing a finishing strike to the kidneys. My opponent's rather close on me, so I'm slowed in, turning him around, coming around into a scissor choke. As he goes to fall, I clutch his arm, popping his arm, tightening his other arm with my leg, popping that, and coming with a finishing strike to the head. Actually, I have my little explanation for you of what we do here. Mm -hmm. uh, let's say, who did the moves first? Jake? Okay. Jake's over here, and he has his number one move. Right? What do I attack? You attack him with a raise in I come to strike him. He goes to move. He goes to do his technique on me. I down, and I finish him off. It's pretty simple. Now, that's his technique. He goes to do his number. What, what do I tap for number two? Reverse or reverse? reverse. It's, it's, uh, it's a follow to the step. I come to come here. He pulls me through. I intercept here. I come back around. Back around again. Take it up down again. From here, I pop his elbow again. Walk around. He's finished off. Huh? Ah, he wanted to, wanted to keep playing. <laughs> Yeah, I stopped to turn and face these guys to explain something. He thinks he's still playing. Oh, I was escaping the game. Okay. <laughs> What's your number three? Number three was a... Okay, watch. Straight through, oh, reverse. Straight through, and I move to the side. He comes here. He's moving with number three. He comes to attack. I intercept him. I take his energy. I rotate it back around. Finish him off. So, what's your number four? He's a right handed punch. I come straight. He's coming back around. I feel this energy. Come back around. Pull him up. Finish him off. Done. What's your. This is an elbow strike. This is right handed side of the hand. My elbow strike? Yes. I come to strike him. He moves back around. He tries to pull me up. Continue your motion. I go with his energy. Again, pull him down. He wanted to roll me over. I stopped him with my knee. Pull this out on him. He screwed. Bam. There goes that arm. Bam. Oh. There goes the wrist. <laughs> and he's done. I remember that time. So, maybe <laughs> 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 Growing pains. Right? Left leg thrust. Left. Uh -oh. I come to do a front thrust. <laughs> he intercepts. As soon as he intercepts. I grab onto his head. I come back down here. He's been out this night. And I can pop it around him. Right? So here, I'm going to torque out his ankle. <laughs> Should I move? The next move. Oh, left jab. Left jab. I can lift jab. He comes to kneel me. Continue your, your. He goes to. Pull me down. I come back around. Turn him out again. Coming into this position. Torquing up. Intercepting the leg. <coughs> He's finished. What's your next one? I was just a right handed straight raise down through. I come to straight competing intercepts. Comes with a kick. Goes to continue his motion. I redirect his energy. Come back up, take him by the center, have control of his head, have his arm, he's done. What number is that? That was eight. <coughs> that was eight. So, I never did this to him. You, you know what I mean? Is this in case the cops ask? 
Hey? <laughs> 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 I just kind of to me that I can see what you're doing because Kriyo is actually with my judo instructor. And he says, you go with the flow like you told me the last time you and I were working out together. Yeah. Whatever he does is now you set up your traps to honor him. So I don't know what he's going to do. I don't even think Exactly. About Correct. Completely Only in the judo competition you're not allowed to do all that things. But again, this is more fun part. But I can do the same thing with everybody's eight moves. Right. I agree. It, it doesn't matter. You just let your body go and that's it. Right. Because I don't think about it. Yes. Exactly. And everything comes into place. Right? Then he helps you. So you can see what I mean? So yeah. realistically, what, when you're saying, I'm is there X amount of moves or X amount of this, there's just X amount of understanding how the body works and doesn't work, and utilizing to take energy and redirect it and control people with it. Huh? And again, with my first judo competition, a guy tried to do a, a Ipan Tegan Ayami. Now I'm going to give him my shoulder so he pulled the arm off. And then yeah. the hospital <laughs> Because I wouldn't let him give it to him instead of countering him with something else. Oh, there he is. He is very good. Come on, Mike. I think he's over. He's trying to take you down by moving backwards. Founders, arm bar, right? Take the back up. You want to roll around? I take him by the wrist. Rolls back around. I stand him out. He's finished. If I want to reach around and choke him, <laughs> if I want to pull out his eyes, I can pull out his eyes. Fish lick, fish hook him. He, he's done. Pressure point him. <laughs> Number two, what strike? Come out with the left hand. Move back. He comes out the left hand. He intersects, so I can't do it. See how I redirected his energy from punching me? Intercepting this arm? Come back down. He was smart. He went with it. So I popped him back this way. Taking him back down around. Notice it's across the arm. Right? He's going to be back here again, right? What's your next one? Let's check. Move out. You throw a left hand. Move out, no, straight through, straight through. Try to strike here. As I take your knee, I'm trying to buckle your arm. He's buckling my arm, I go straight down, so I'll go back and buckle arm, okay? He takes like his arm, I go down with it. Again, he goes down to it. We, we have a deja vu. This one here, ah! Popping his, his leg out. Next one. Or is, uh, you throw a, uh, Rear right legged thrust kick, and I catch it. Again, as soon as he intercepted me, I got a hold of him. Right. He goes to throw me, and I take him with me. I go to take this arm, um, um, and then rotate him around, and then we're here again. Key lock. Down center, he's done. He gets the elbows. Next. <laughs> you can't remember it, yeah. I don't blame him. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I grab hold of him, he comes around, I redirect the circle, continue the motion, do the technique on him. He comes around, I continue the circle. Oh, should have gave that to me. <laughs> then I rotate him over again. Ooh, he's slippery. Oh, notice this torque. Oh. What, you don't want to roll? <laughs> there you go. And then back here again, where you can have the days of uh. this. So again, it's happy birthday to me. You're right, yeah. <laughs> I rolled through mine. <laughs> I rolled through mine. Number eight, yeah. 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 This is working his shoulder, <laughs> causing an excruciating oh, pain. <laughs> Smile. And it was working on an outbed wrist lock at the same time. 
Yeah, yeah. 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 What's next? Yeah. Straight through. Straight through. I come here. He's, he's coming. This is a choke. Pull me back. I'll be back there. Took him back down again. I just have to the arm with my ribs. Pop the round. I wanted to do this this way. He's done again. I can finish him off from here. What's next? The number eight. Come through with the big right hand. I step out on the number eight direction, movement line, do a wire technique. I don't care what you do. I just want to know how I hit you. Big right hand. I come through with a big right hand. He comes through. Been here before. I take him out. Well, he didn't go that way. He went the other way. We rotate it around again. And then we're in this position. Oh. I'm, I'm twerking on his ankle, by the way. Oh, okay. In case anybody doesn't understand this. <laughs> That's not very good. Like, I don't have to think of eight moves. I don't have to rehearse eight moves. I could do the same thing without these one or you would know about my next. <laughs> <laughs>